I get already almost all the way up. Come on. See, I got two axes now, which is not bad. Power swipe, and he's dead. Okay, what's over here? Ah, a chest. Of course. I gotta explore the area so I can get all these common core crystals. Because I know you need 10 core crystals for a certain quest. There's nothing else I can do here. Um, I'm going to beat Dagus here. Alright, do it. Oh, uh, they all aggroed onto me. This is not good. More egg. If you could uh, get aggro, that would be great. Alright, let's just try and do this as quick as possible. Take them all out. More eggs gonna go down. Or not. That's fine. Alright. The quicker we take out more of them, the quicker this will go. Alright, almost have Dark Tide. Ah, perfect. Ah, uh, no, don't let Moray go down. Thank you. There we go. Perfect. Do this. Come on, Agus. Dagus. There we go. As long as Dia keeps healing, that's all that matters. Go go for the uh, aqua wave. I think is what it's called. Just kill him. There's only two left. I hate him fucking blocking like that. You know what? Just do it. There we go. One more. Do it, there you go. There, finally, Jesus. I'll, yeah, we'll be fine. More chests. I'll open everything. Give me everything in here. Thank you. Thank you so much. There was another one over here. I can open this door as well. No. Guess not. Okie dokie. Let's just go then. Because it seems like I'm wasting some time here. Oh, this is going to be a long cutscene. I'm going to save it in case uh, I get stuck into something that I'm not ready for. Can I help you guys? Yes, hello. Pyra! up in some kind of restraint look ahead ah they're gonna kill her uh. that's the omega fetter an ether accelerator uh oh i've seen one like it before in old torna it certainly seems like they want us gone for good so if we crank up the output and really focus it we could probably manage one strike if the people here really are the descendants of the Tornans. 
Then I have a message for them that I must pass on. In that case, I'll leave it to you. Thank you, Mithra. He's here. I apologize for this, noble Aegis. I have no personal grievance with you. However, for the sake of this world, you must be destroyed where you stand. Uh, that's probably not a good idea. You desire, your majesty? I believe you desired the same thing yourself once. Is that not why you disappeared from history? Along with Adam the hero? <laughs> Begin. I hate when Rex has to raise his voice. It's awful. It's literally garbage. The what now? It's a weapon from long ago, designed to use Genbu's ether energy for destruction. I never dreamed they'd fully restore it. My old man, he's going to use it to kill Pyra. No matter how strong she is, there'd be no coming back from that. In that case, we can't let him use it. All right, let's take him out. All right, everyone focus. Focus the one guy. Oh, there's so many. It shouldn't be too hard, though. There we go, go for the steam bomb, get some healing on more egg. There we go, get some more damage going. Oh. <laughs> what the, what the? <laughs> I can't, they're, they're blocking too much. They're blocking too much. Come on. There, easy. Right? Easy peasy. What the? Alright, just take him out. There's only like two. Can, can you not? I hate this. Fucking ability. There we go. Give me all that money. That was easy. Surprisingly, that was a lot easier than I thought it would be. All right, we got to stop him. Ah, there's too many of them. Hurry, or pirates toast. I know that. It's just Forgive me. Don't do it. Yeah, do it, Zeke. Woo! It's not enough. Poppy, activate QT mode. Lift up from below. Understood, Master Pie. Hell yeah. Do it, Poppy. Do it. Yeah, get that shit out of here. Ooh, what is that? Oh, that's not good. Nice. Perfect. That was a nice catch. That was a really nice catch.
500 years. For 500 years, we Tantalese have concealed the Omega Fetter. Do you know why? Um. Our old homeland, Tornan, was destroyed in the Aegis War. Our hero, Adam, also failed to return. You must understand... He did not want to return. Old Torna as a country was united around the hero. But our ancestors less so. What are you saying? That we're not Adam's bloodline? <clears throat> Precisely. In Torna, our family were just a cadet branch. We only gained our current position in the confusion of the war's aftermath. But then... We're just a bunch of usurpers! Yep. They were desperate times. We had no choice. The nation must continue at all costs. Ah, oh, whatever. Even if it meant claiming Adam's name. With its guiding force gone, much blood was spilled in Torna. We did what had to be done to reunite it under the new banner of Tanta. Legends of the hero who saved the world are deeply ingrained in people's hearts. And you used them for your own political agenda. Yeah. Even Sounds so, about right. All was done in the name of saving the world from burning once more. Yeah, whatever. Don't you dare try and sugarcoat it. Short story is, they saw an opportunity to gain influence and they took it. Gah! That is the way of the world. No, that's bullshit. <laughs> can easily take a similar path. Yes, we are in no position to condemn them outright. So did this Adam guy really never return? Indeed. The records indicate he went missing immediately after sealing away the Aegis. It is likely he simply perished during the journey home. Yeah, probably. He didn't just go missing. What did you say? He just... Adam. He had foreseen everything. Yes, go on. He knew what would happen to the people after the kingdom fell. But he chose not to return. Adam left us of his own will. But why? Ah, nifty little earring you got there. Hear me, my science. I am Adam Origo. This day I seal the Aegis, away from the world. But this seal is not for eternity. In anticipation of the day that humanity becomes worthy of the Aegis's power, I entrust her to posterity. All right, go on. She is our hope. When mankind has matured and learned to live better lives, she will answer your call and return to you. Trusting that day will come, I leave my final wish to you. Fancy earring. Adam foresaw much confusion and hardship in the world ahead. And when I seemed unsure, he told me something. This is a trial. Is me sleeping a part of the trial? Yes. That's right. It is a trial for us humans, one we must overcome ourselves. If we cannot do that, we don't deserve to live alongside you. Live alongside? To be honest, I still don't fully understand what he meant by that. 
whether he simply meant the coexistence of humans and blades, or something more. But I think he made a difficult choice. Well, yeah. Obviously. For the sake of everyone's survival. Whoa. Your Majesty. What is this? It's Genbu. Of course it's Genbu. He's free of our control and started to dive into the clouds. What? Are you certain? <laughs> Pandy! Oh, oh no! She like linked to Genbu? What exactly is happening? Could it be that blast? What is he... Tantal keeps Genbu under control using the Omega Fetter. But firing the ether accelerator, it could have created a counterflow in Genbu's ether conduits, causing a critical overload. So Genbu's broken. Yeah. Oh no, my words can't reach him anymore. Genbu is just going to dive deeper and deeper. Then. Domo, git! That's what happens when you use antiquated parts. The cloud sea has a similar density to water. As we dive, the pressure will keep building. And then crush. By 500 pets, a human would be crushed completely. And all that force will weigh down on Genbu? What's our depth now? 2200 pets, sir. Ah, shit. We are diving at a rate of 120 pets per minute. And Genbu's depth limit? 25,000, give or take. That'll give us just over three hours. All right. Whoa, shall let's get a maths. Bite me. This ain't good. Hey, chum, there's a pressure resistant pod in the palace's southern tower. You guys at least should get in and escape. What about you and everyone else? Don't worry about us. Nah, we're gonna help so you. I possibly not worry about you. Isn't there any other way? Some way to save everyone. Only Pandoria can tell Genbu what to do. If it won't budge for her, it's no use. Apart from that, all we can do is try to evacuate as many people as we can. But with just three hours. I think you mentioned before. You control Genbu using the Omega Fetter, right? Uh, yeah, but... Where is it? Inside Genbu's head. Yeah, we could do that it's easy. Straight south from the palace, through Genbu's spinal column. I will go. You'll go? Pyro, what are you... Yeah, the be Omega easy. Fetter is originally Ophion's control core. And Ophion... Is my artifice. I can't be 100% sure, but I think I might be able to fix it. Pyra. All right. That sounds good. Pyra being serious? They tried to kill Pyra one minute ago. That's a totally separate issue. Isn't that what you'd say, Rex? What? Oh, yeah. I guess it is. And that's why. And Pyra. Tora get it. Then Tora and Poppy also lend help. Looks like we're in too, Druma. I would have it no other way. That's settled then. Stay out of our way, old man. Got it? You and all risk your lives. Yeah, we'll be fine. For the sake of Tantal, though we attempted to destroy the Aegis. It's not about Tantal. Then why? You're a king, right? You ought to be able to figure it out. Rex, you are... Morag? 
You leave me little choice. Zeke, where was the fetter again? How do we get there? I won't just tell you. I'll take you right to it. Nice. Zeke. Save it, old man. You better make a start on evacuating the people. Though with us on the case, your efforts are probably going to be wasted. Understood. No time for chit chat. Let's go. Yeah. All right, let's do it. Now the path to the Omega Feather isn't an easy one. The city Theosaur is positioned a long way above Gembu Drifts. If you head out the palace and down to the left, you'll see the ruins of a place called Therospita Temple. Ruins, even though inside city. Yep, they really are ruined too. Practically rotted away. Anyway, past the temple ruins is something called the Theosaur Rear Gate. We head out through there. Then we have to follow the pillars a long way down. Sounds like a pain in the arse of a journey. But must be quick. Come on, friends, to Genbu Drifts. Hey, I'm not done yet. Once we get to Genbu Drifts, we have to head across it. That gets us to the place called the Great Pillar Passage. The Omega Feathers at the end of that. Sounds too long. Tori already getting tired just listening. Too soon for getting tired, Master Pond. This is no time for joking around, Tora. We have to give this our all and protect Zeke's home. Of course. Right, let's all do what we can. Thank, uh, thanks, guys. I owe you big time. Uh, so first, we should head out to the left. Got that? To the left. All right. And I'll probably play as them some more. Head out to the left. All right, guys. Well, with that, I'm going to wrap it up here. So I'd like to thank you guys for watching. And as always, stay awesome. And I will see you guys in the next video.